So what's up guys? Uh, welcome back. This is my boy Gia Adam Slink and my boy here, yeah, local man. If yeah. I may call you boy today. Uh, welcome back to another crazy program and uh, good morning, afternoon, evening, depending on where you guys are watching this video from. And please eh, try to like the video. Come on, man. You cannot leave a comment without liking. The like is very important as much as the comment. You understand what I mean, Abi? End of the month is coming really, really soon, eh? Very soon. Very, very, very soon. And I cannot we, wait. We are working towards it. I cannot it. wait to have the first five or first ten or first twenty person or even first hundred person. Eh? It mm -hmm. depends on how much we need to get that. You yeah. understand? It depends on how much you view and how you share the video, how much money enters. Oh, large. I'll get to you. So you can as well determine how much we gain at the end of the month. Mm -hmm. So that being said, uh, let's talk about this social media of a thing. This is not the first time they're actually coming to regulate our social media. They don't want to allow us to talk anymore. They want to reduce our freedom of speech. I don't know if that's what they're trying to do, but now the, the Tunubu's government has uh, taken over from the Buhari's government and now they are continuing with the social media regulation. In fact, as art. Yesterday, they said why social media must be regulated, coming from President Tonobo himself. Not himself, but somebody, somebody. You know, whenever the presidency talk, they are generally associated with Tonobo. Does not Tonobo talk. So the President Bola Ahmed Tonobo says social media has become a societal menix and must be regulated. They said the social media must be society uh, has become a societal meaning and must be regulated. As many people do not understand that once the send button is hit, there is potential to reach millions of people around the world, which is capable of causing or causing a greater danger, not just in the society, but even unintended consequences to the individuals that are receiving information which they which may include security of life as citizens become more interested in governance it is the government obligation to ensure that engagement with citizens springs with share ag agreement on what the truth is what is real and what is not he said no, our problem with that one for now. Yeah, I think that's our problem. That to, is, that to regulate and to try to give the right information. That is not our problem. When the when police tell you, say, what well, most of all those kidnapping cases you are seeing online. Are fake news. Saying that, fake media. news. that is what social media causes. Now, waiting, based on the ritual of the time about this stuff, now, waiting, as they say, they try to shut down. You know, they say we take democracy. Now, for me, people like me now, Mm -hmm. They don't have the power. They don't have the connection to go out there and talk to them. This is the only way I can do it through social media. Now, if they shut down down now, I want they complain. The, uh, you are asking the government to sh no. To ask, no. Also, want to do no. With um, you know, not that I'm asking them. I'm just saying the way I feel, as in because what we are going through now, the problem of the country. No be social media be the problem. If say social media bring our own issue now, about reason and say yes, this is not the cause much issue. Social media never bring out any issue. We be say it will cause problem for country. Then why is that one affecting them? So I believe they don't want us to to talk or to complain anymore. So one said the things the government should try to regulate first, fair price. Yes. Second, dollar rate. Yes. Third, three hundred percent increment or in full stuff. Yeah. Insecurity. Adjust poverty. Adjust unemployment. Mm -hmm. Chronic corruption within your colleagues. Mm -hmm. Regulate that first. Eh? Go we bless that person. That's because, coming from this guy. Uh. You can't tell me that. Then, then another, okay. another, another person said, remake, they should also go on and regulate cement price. Cost that rubber of Gary is now almost 2K. Yes, now. <laughs> so, you know, if you tell me, say all those issues, 
Now social media be your problem. One kilo of gas, how much you buy yesterday? One thousand two fifty for one kilo. What we buy as at uh, last year, video of last year, was he pay ten thousand naira, nine thousand something for to fill twelve kg. Uh, 12 kg of my gas cylinder. Yeah, but now you are now paying 15, 15 plus. I will continue like before. And you it's, not the, it's not in the space of how many so, years. So I, I think maybe social media also lied about that as well. About what? About the gas price now. No, Just maybe. Nobody waiting me. Nobody waiting me. Wait me you go buy. Bread is now one thousand. One thousand. One two one five. One five. So, maybe social media is lying against that. Maybe business. social media they lie now. They don't want to talk or, anymore. Or maybe, just maybe, a uh, dollar rate has skyrocketed. You don't have a social media, bro. Maybe it's social media that is lying about that. Now you're talking. Now you have a social media too. Now. So the very good thing, I just believe they don't know what they are doing because they just find way to shut us out of the game. Uh, I wish you no. Know, if you say no, be democracy with it. This man tell you for self aware. No. Tell you tell you. No be saying a mouth. If you say no be, see, no be see, democracy see, with this. See the honest truth I keep saying about yeah. that Tunubu is that eh? is that eh? Tunubu is just eight months into the into the into, the, into presidency. That eight months, they are eight years. And we have been saying no, it, it, eight years, not eight years. Old. I say I asked this question the other time. I said, is it is that enough time to turn Nigeria around? Mm -hmm. Why don't we give him like a little bit of two years? I know, I know, uh, After all, our religious leaders uh, over here, because Nigeria, they, they like prayers. Well, well. Yeah. They rather go to church and pray for economy to be better. Yeah. They have told us to pray. They have told us to keep quiet. They have told us to pray and be hopeful. Mm -hmm. Let's give them time. But all the same though, if you check eight months, seven months, it's not enough now. Mm -hmm. If we are realistic, it's not enough to turn around the country that has been that has been deep in like deep corruption. Uh, in, 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 in eight I get your point. You know, it's not enough. Some level of hardship, or if, if we if we understand, if we are honestly in our heart, some level of hardship. I know people will not understand though that are speaking for Tunubu, but if we just normally realize whatever thing and we are like be in our heart open up the, the, we must surely pass through some level of hardship in order to go to the right place okay. because at the end of the day all those these things that are happening are deeply rooted by the elites okay. and also deeply rooted by majority of nigerians who don't want the country to go so now the level of hardship we are talking about now most all of us die before the country turn around. You see, within the country they turn to already. No, my own. What may I notice that seven month, eight month, we know you, you can't change the country for, for a better one between that month. But at least, who did the way we did? Now we are we are going back, back, back. You know, you know how many people they die per day based on this hardship? We are not going backward. We are going backward, bros. We are going for, because if you are going backward, the uh, mm. dollar was uh, how many, how many, how many, uh, how many, uh, that means dollar was better backward as at that time. <laughs> as now, I think I, I'm not getting you. I said we are not going backward. We are going backward. You know why? Yeah. Dollar was better backward. <laughs> What better? A vision to the dollar and do it to the book and what a vision was better. Better, a vision. But bro, when they go backward, it's just yeah, the, we are skyrocketing. As in, <laughs> see things will happen for the country day by day. See, see, uh, see. Uh, uh, in as much as they like laugh about this matter, people might say I'm not concentrated. Eh? I'm laughing towards Nigerians. You know why? I keep saying it. We are not ready. Mm. I can vow to you that eighty percent of Nigerians do not want this country to be better. Eighty. Eighty. No, I no agree. Well, lie. I mm. will tell you the. Let me tell the statistics. If you tell me ten. Let me tell the statistics. Uh, yeah. How many people do on social media? How many people? How many of the percentage of Nigerians do on social media? No, not up to fifteen. Oh, let me say twenty percent. Okay. Not up to fifteen. How many of them get for? How many of them? You and I saw an instance where they did a share toothpaste. 
Do and I saw instance when they go they praise the PC women. Yeah. Now the hardship cause all this rubbish now. You are saying the hardship. Yeah. That's why I said they are not ready. You, 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 we keep blaming it on hardship. Uh, that is bro. not right. Now the hardship. Now food, now food. Okay, then let us be blaming it on food. That's how we are going to blame it on food, on hardship. Till the next 10 years, we still be no. blaming it on food. Listen. We will be giving excuses to people who don't, cannot eat. Eh? That they don't want to liberate themselves. And the best option for them is to collect from those people that are oppressing them. That is the excuse we've got to give them. That's the only excuse now. now. Yes, now. Then that, that is why I will keep making mockery of the situation of telling Nigerians that the country is better. This thing you are talking about, eh? If you won't have one for free, Nigeria wait, is better. Wait, let me tell you something. We this, continue. This thing you are talking, if you have if, if happen for a uh, foreign country mm -hmm. and they came out to share food, and the country they go through hardship. People will see come out to collect their food. Uh, keep using, okay, keep giving excuses. So now the excuse now is not about you collecting the food or not collecting it. It's about what? Because number one, if I'm hungry and I see free food, I will collect and eat. Oh, good so for you. Keep That's me, one of To keep me going. Give free food for me for people who are wait, oppressing you. Wait now. Now when I eat, now I have best friend to fight. If I don't eat, I don't be facing for fights. Then there's no contest. If I don't eat, I don't be challenging. Let me tell you. If I don't who eat, I don't be talk to you. Okay. You cannot get the strength. Okay, let me not tell you something. Let me not tell yeah. you something. Me that is oppressing you. Yeah. I'm giving you food to eat. Am I stupid that I will give you food that will fill you up to make you have power to fight me? As the government give us anything that will fill us up to say time to rise? No. They will draw smoke, man. Eat that one, Belefuna now. Tomorrow, no go eat again. You eat You'll again. Come again. So, yes. if you keep giving us, you say you want their food, I will have food from the government. I will have food from our oppressor to eat in order for them to fight them. You will never get food, food in this life. You know, the thing, uh, based on what you are saying now, okay, giving food or not giving food, which are especially which you to talk are we ready to go fight these people? Are we ready to come out? Because it's not about this food. It's about food. It's not about this food. It, it, let me tell you why it's about food. Let me tell you why. Okay, it's simple. Oh. I gave you instances. They, they share my clip there the other day. Yeah. yeah. They, they share all those stipenses there the other time. And they are rushing to collect. To collect. Why are they collecting? It's because of their personal belly. Yeah. They, they want to fill their belly. Yeah. When a man overlooks what he wants to eat, a liberation starts. From that day, liberation starts from that day. That day, when you start overlooking what he wants to eat today, because the devil are acting as an angel, angel, uh, agent of, of heaven, also to you, by giving you food, and you start seeing that. That's why the country, okay, what did that put today? People are ready to die for politicians. Because of what? Because of the sharing of money. The opinion they are giving Why? Why? Imagine you are there for your politician. If a country best than politician, then money pass a private sector. It don't happen before for any country that want to develop. No. They, they give us stipends. They give us stipends. Hmm? They give us stipends. You they go they worship them and in the, on the other vein of your dirty mouth, of your dirty mouth, of your stinky mouth for collecting that food. Say so dollar don't high, dollar don't high, dollar don't high. Food don't cost. Food don't cost. Food they increase. Food they increase. But in the other vein, you they collect. You chop. This country, eh? eh? This country is best country ever. You know what I'm talking about? Huh? Okay. The government are performing excellently well. For the social media, may allow us talk. Honestly. But Buhari government is going to the point. Like the real point of say yes, this is how to govern the country, whether you like it or not. This is how Nigerians want to be governed. You cannot argue that with me. If it's not, then why are we not changing it? You say because of food. Poverty now. <laughs> That's what we get. So let's that. leave that. Okay. Let's talk about uh, Niger State Governor. Still because of food again. People they complain, say food no day, price of food increase. And the easiest way for a governor to think is that ah, 
we, we won't be as, uh, exporting any food again to every other state. I, 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 I can't like understand because maybe they might be exploiting it. Mm -hmm. These farmers, these farmers who don't want to sell because Nigerians are greedy. Yeah, oh yeah. These farmers don't want to sell to their neighbor, neighboring they villages to because of the reprisal yeah. law. They prefer to take it out to other states. Well, let me play you the video, guys, of the guy. Trucks who come to park or buy foodstuffs from our villagers in Borg should be halted for now. We have stopped mass purchase from our local market in all our local government from now henceforth until further notice. Anybody found doing that, we have given security agencies go ahead to confiscate those trucks and share the food to the people. Thank you. Well, you know, where did this all cause? More increase of prices in the market. So the question is that they want to stop food coming out from the state, mm -hmm. but they don't want to stop food coming in. Ah. That's foolishness. Ah, that's not my own way. Because now. you know, I say that's foolishness. Now you want to own your own, but receive other people's own. Then if other people. Then if, what if other people stop their own too? Then I think, I think it will be a way of them coming together to say, okay. Uh, why? Okay, it's about time we start cutting these prices. Nigeria no get IQ at all. See, see, so for, me, uh, for me, uh, for me, for me, no get IQ. for me, uh, for me, uh, yeah, you people might that. not think the way I, I think. Oh, for me, yeah. Okay. Although it might not be good coming from the governor, but I think it's a positive vibe, a positive. This thing that uh, we might hit positivity from it. In which way? In which way? Because you already mentioned it. If he stop you, hmm? mm -hmm. of course, as a good governor in another state, you stop. have to fight back. Okay, you stop, stop. him. Okay. Then another governor from another state stop. Okay. This governor from another state stop. Okay. If everybody stop like that, okay. share it with others, eh? something will be triggered. Negotiation. Well, okay. Negotiation will be triggered. Okay. And the only negotiation is that oh, we have to beat down prices. The price will come down there. For this so called Nigeria country. Ah, that is what is going to trigger. Mm -hmm. Okay, what is the man trying to achieve? What is this government trying to achieve? To me, this one is a part of it. To me, a self center. No, no, it's not self center. No, it's self center, no. bro. As, see, as a governor, we, as we, a governor, yeah. what is your responsibility? You take care of your people. Take care of your people. Your people first in your mind. I know your people first. Eh? I know. It's not people. to take care of. You must be your pro people first. Eh? Your people, you are in Nigeria. People first, eh? govern your people first before any other state. Eh? Before any other state. He is ensuring his people eat well. Okay. He knows his capacity. He knows what they can produce. Yam or whatever they are producing. He knows that the future for with yam, chop, or all that is. You understand? Eh? He knows. So he say, okay, let us keep so on. So what of those are they produce? Ooh, which, which other state? I mean, what of those one, those food stuff where that state will they produce? Like what? I'm just asking. Now all the old food stuff they state will they produce? Like what? I'm just asking. I don't know. All those who are made other state, the other state not the hey, hey, that's what I'm saying now. If you all so your they only own, eat what they produce. If you hold your own, you as a responsible governor to your whole state, you have to make a decisive. Uh, uh, you 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 have to make a decisive. Uh, a commitment or what I may call it. Me, I don't see that one as a solution to me. It is not a solution, it's a buyer solution. I know. Yeah, and that's what I'm saying now. But it's, it's going now. to lead to something if it continues. And in this country, it won't lead to anything. In our suffer with us, now more sufferness. And now we they suffer around. Because based on it's from Ninja State, right? Like for him now, he have no problem, he can go to any country, any state to eat. What are other people? They already think about their self, themselves, themselves, self center, self center. And at the self center, push up to this level all day. Why will you stop food going out from your state? But if your another food is coming in, you will welcome it. Then I want to ask you this question. Okay. If your own, that's a governor of a state, okay. your own citizen are quarreling a buy increase of prices, okay. what will you do? I will find a way out now, not for me to stop. No, 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 no. You are not saying what you do. You can't do anything because because you don't understand what it feels. Eh? Your people now they protest are told you now. Mm -hmm. And they protest, that protest they protest massively. Mm -hmm. Protesting that the people are 
hungry. be hungry. The things are too expensive. Yeah. Who told you he never had taken old meeting with his own people with the group? Yeah, they, 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 so the solution, they say things are, are, are hard. The farmers don't want to say things to them again. They rather give it outside. See, democracy eh, is the government by the people for the people. You listen to the people. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, eh, if that since since they feel like you cannot render any solution, and this is a global matter, a Nigerian matter, a global matter. You have faced all states. There's nothing you can do that will listen to his people and say, okay, let me out you since it's what you people want. No, which I go go now, but me and nobody, and nobody there. Then there be uh, the other one, just a female kidnapper that was uh, that was caught um, collecting money for kidnappers by the Nigeria troops, uh, uh, the gallant uh, Nigeria troops. But all the same, I don't know if you have seen the picture. Yeah, I've seen it. Right there. Mm. All the same, it is. Uh, I think it's not. It is. It should be surprising that you guys are seeing female. I know, I know. Um, um, I know they did the game. The, the they did pass, like what they said, a, a, what a man can do. A woman can do better. A woman can do it. Better. This one must say, "Na pick and na pick, na pick the pick." So yeah. the woman can do it better. Who will you say to pick? Na woman that's so clean and that. No go, no go expect. Hmm? But God will continue to arrest them us and uh, arrest them if you check uh, the kidnapping matter though it, it reduce it reduced my drastically it's not as before uh, let us say the truth it's not as rampant as it was last two weeks last two years so yeah it has kind of like a reduce and i hope it reduce from here you don't want to hear and see all those things are distractions if we start making excuses and say because of hardship of nigeria uh it's going to that means if they kidnap you you don't get right to talk Let's stop making excuses. People make excuses for irrelevant things. They are not straightforward with their thoughts. No, nowadays, if you talk truth, it's no longer true. People don't want to hear them. Yeah. You ask for solutions. So somebody thought truth. Basically saying that because of the insecure, ah, hunger, hunger, hunger. No, no, no. That's not an excuse. That's not an excuse. You and I, you know the stuff. You know the kind of uh, things we go through? You see the part of hunger, bro. Huh? I know it's agree with you. Hunger is if you concentrate. Okay, if you cost person, put the kidnap. Uh, most of no be everybody be called a ship. I'm telling you, if you be say, say uh, they support them, don't get me you wrong. You cannot say you cannot have wait, problems. wait now. No be everybody be called a ship. Based on our time, you get our time. We be say I don't face. We be say sometimes we look up, look down. But I have conscience. I can't automate me like me. So I will be, prove you wrong, now. Okay, and prove you, me wrong. And, and you not don't finish your statement. And I have conscience. I can't automate like me. Mm -hmm. But some people, any small ship, they don't care. Maybe you die, you leave. Mm -hmm. They will go ahead and do what they want to do to make that money. Okay. So because if the everything is going well, nobody say if everything is going well for the country, nobody say crime no go deal, but no go reach this level. Okay. Even the last president, who they talk, uh, the former president, who they talk, crime no much like this now. You know much reach this level now. Why can't no much reach this level? Because the hardship then no reach this level. Mm -hmm. Then the more the hardship, the more the crime. Take it or not. Okay, okay. Now you have made your claim. Yeah. You said that because of hunger, now they make people they run into uh, crime. Crime. Yeah. Criminality. Then I want to ask you. Let me use a simple example. Maybe, maybe you and I go do our going with. How much does a man need to remove himself or out of hunger? Independent man, now. that's not a direct question. Now. How much do an ordinary person, a poor family, needs? Eh, to needs. What do you feel? I say, if if you say you want to help this family, how much you feel say you will give them for them to eat for a month? You want to give them monthly yes. or just for one month? Monthly. How much do you think? It depends on the size of the family now. If it's family of five, how much do you think? Bro, it depends. It depends where I say family of five. You have a family. Yeah. You don't you have the kid, you have a child, you have a wife. Family of three. How much you need to job for a month? For a month. Yes, a uh minimum. Not lavishly. Yes, that can sustain you. Yes, hundred K. Hundred K. Family of five, possibly one hundred and fifty or two hundred yeah, yeah. in a month. Yeah. Kidnappers, they are all boys. Why did I say they will eat millions? Why can't they stop? And I guess why we call it greediness. You see, you make excuses for a man for being hung hungry. Firstly, 
the man don't get money, may go sustain her. Now you start putting it on greedy. Uh, you made excuses for him at the first place, first place. Now you the toss say it's not greediness. Why are you making excuses for him at the first place? When you know, say you go graduate for being greedy. A kidnapper who say he needs to eat. That's why go kidnapping. We go to a a a a a, 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 a later. I shall go ask later, go sleep with numerous girls and drink by, by wine and drink all those drinks. And now Baba will do the same thing. A kidnapper will kidnap women and also rape them. And you say it's hunger. You make excuses for them. I get your point, Sharon. <laughs> your point. Don't get my point. <laughs> your point. So, it's not hunger. It's, 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 it's pure wickedness. Yeah. If not, uh, we should all go into kidnapping. Yeah, that is true, sure. We go kidnap kidnapper. Kidnapper will kidnap us today. You know, if I will say kidnap them tomorrow, the money will they share around like that. Me all of us going to kidnap it. Uh, kidnap it. What's the need of uh, uh, governance? It's a distraction to society. It's, it, that is, looks like an option to people. Me, they no fight for their rights. Right. After all, they say, oh, yeah, well, now, why don't we do the yeah, for their government? After all, there's kidnapping. Why not do kidnap and forget government with it in eating my business? It's a distraction not to put our head in the right place. It's not an excuse, it's no hunger. I tell you give an excuse to a man for hunger. Ah uh, okay, why you know they still you only still you know you need to chop? Why you know still don't say I kidnap you because say I need this money? Why ask it for 400 million? million. Eh, ask it for 15 million, you keep us enjoying because you are hungry. Why don't you plead and say, please, see, I kidnapped your daughter because I am hungry. Eh? So I need time. money, my monthly money, me, I want to feed my family. It's 200,000. Hmm? Please send it. <laughs> you go say that way now. Thank you guys for watching, boy. Yeah, that's a wonderful day. Bless. Bye.